so this is the reason why god wakes you up at midnight have you ever wondered why you always wake up at midnight you just have to continue watching this video in case you are new here for the first time you are so welcome my name is pamela in case you have been following me thank you so much for always stopping by may god bless you so i'll be telling you why god wakes you up at midnight if you always find yourself waking up between 12 a.m to 3 a.m you have to know that this is the reason why you always wake up between this time subscribe to this channel if you love messages like this also turn on the bell so that whenever i upload videos you get notified and come and watch do share this video because it really go a long way to help lots of people have you ever wondered why you wake up around midnight like when you are always enjoying your sleep that the time that people are always resting enjoying their restful sleep have you ever wondered some people wake up around this time due to health reason maybe because they have slept for long all the day during the day they slept a long time and at night they wake up that can be normal but i want to tell you that there is a spiritual significance attached to it you waking up around this time everything is controlled spiritually you have to always reason spiritually because the world we are living is controlled spiritually spiritual controls physical so you always have to reason that way no matter what when you find yourself waking up at midnight especially around 3 a.m just know this there's a spirit behind everything we see there's a spirit behind any little thing that comes across you that you come across nothing happens by chance just have to take note these are the things that always happen at midnight dream you find yourself dreaming like i always say in some messages i pass through god can reveal messages through dreams evil ones can also reveal messages through dreams so if you find yourself dreaming at midnight because spiritual controls physical so it controls everything about you even your sleep is controlled spiritually when you are sleeping you don't know things that goes around you don't know what happens it's only your spirit that moves around that wanders around if you are strong spiritually your spirit will come back to you and wake up together revelations you get revelation at midnight whether you are sleeping whether you are awake it happens to lots of people dreams happens at midnight revelations happens at midnight attacks happens at midnight you see so many people they will just wake up with a loud shout with a disturbing sleep they will shout with a loud voice that is when you will be hearing so many attack people experience attacks when they sleep that is enough to show you that there is something that happens at midnight so many spiritual things spiritual forces happens at midnight so you don't have to just joke with it or just sleep after that attack you have to do the needful and doing this and you notice a solution or you notice a relief should tell you that oh that means i should be waking up at midnight visitations of the spirit's world it happens at night people get visited at midnight by the spirit world the demonic powers or the angelic powers they visit one at midnight so it's not only the evil ones that are oppressed at midnight angelic powers angels from god comes visiting at midnight they come across your bed washing over you if you invite them but if you are living some kind of life, you end up inviting demonic powers to come and possess that environment. That is why you always have to build your spiritual life. Luke chapter 6, verse 12. Read from 12 to 13. Jesus went into the hills, into the high hills, spent the whole night praying to God Almighty. Yes, at midnight, he went to the high hills, praying to the Father, to his Father, to God Almighty. Many people, they cannot even wake up at this time. Maybe because they have been stressed out all the day. But I want to tell you that you don't really need a long time to pray. A little time goes a long way. You just have to form the habit of praying around this time. It will really go a long way to destroy some evil forces that is against your life. It will go a long way to bring a strong relationship, a strong connection between you and God Almighty. And as you pray or ask anything, you see it supplied. That God Almighty says, ask and it shall be given unto you. 
seek and you shall find knock and the door shall be opened unto you does not mean that even when you commit sin that those sins will come to you no this promise is only for those that believe in god almighty that do those things that pleases god that that have a clean heart not for everybody there's a spiritual significance behind you waking up within 12 a.m you know to 3 a.m have you ever wondered why some people receive messages through spiritual dreams have you ever wondered about that especially at midnight you see so many people receiving so many revelations dreams will be coming through and you see that those dreams will be coming to pass and you see some people always experiencing attack especially at midnight so like i said i just believe that everything happens for a reason so you don't have to take it for granted always know that this midnight time is when god washes over us the angels of god are always surrounded if you do the things that god love if you're always a upright person how do you spend your day how was your day do you live your day committing so many atrocities so many sins treating people wrongly just know that night is coming midnight is coming how do you live your life during the day always keep a very upright life so that during the night you will not be fearful so that you will welcome good spirits automatically god is watching over us and know what is right for us as you live your life that is how you invite the presence of god that time that you are not aware of what goes on god will send these angels to surround you and protect you that time that you are physically weak you are spiritually weak as well you see the angels of god surrounded but when you do those things that does not please god you automatically attract those demonic powers to wash over you and you know what that means destruction they don't mean where well, no matter what no matter how you place it no matter how you look at it they will never mean well to you many people they go to one place to the other seeking for protection getting incision demonic incision marital incision on their body you are automatically inviting demonic forces attacks especially at midnight you are telling them come and protect me that they will, they should come and protect you you don't need the power of god you need those power demonic powers that is why during the day you go searching for their protection and at night when they come you'll be so afraid they come through attacks they come through nightmares so many evil will be happening you see some people they will sleep they will not be able to wake up they are not strong enough to fight the battle so these two reasons are reason why god wakes you at midnight communication god wants you to communicate to him he knows what is right for you but he wants you to open your mouth to communicate to him he wants to make sure that you love him that you need him that is the most important thing god wants to make sure that you need him so you have to communicate open your mouth and ask god directly seek him tell him what you want the communication is very important in every areas of one's life communicating with god will make you covered telling god that you need him that you cannot do without him god gives us wake up call around this time because to bring us to our senses during the day you lived some kind of life you did so many things at midnight he wants you to be on your right senses to wake up that is when you see yourself at midnight you just open your eyes without anybody waking you there's these spiritual forces behind that so you don't have to take it for granted by waking up go to ease yourself to go to the restroom and go back to bed even if it's a small prayer say some little prayer it will go a long way to help you you don't know what is happening if god is tapping you or waking you up to counter the works of the evil ones so many things are happening you don't know that evil that is yet to happen and you just woke up so as you wake up around this time just take advantage of it by praying seriously communicate with god almighty tell god what you want those things that you are lacking that your struggle during the day tell god your mind tell god what you want tell god your intention 
your plants and you see it solved. The right place to seek for protection is from God Almighty. It's communicating with God, telling God what you want, that you need protection. You will see God protecting you by sending angels to protect you. Just like he says in Psalm 91, God will send these angels charge over us to protect you. So now I believe you know why you always wake up around this time. Do not take it for granted. Take advantage of it. Communicate with God Almighty. Tell God anything you want and you see God supplying and providing it for you. Total protection will be your portion all the days of your life after now. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe. Share this video to everyone. Remain blessed as always. I will see you in my next video.